I believe that school should be fun. In fact, it's incredibly important. The impact of this work is so fulfilling and significant. And it all starts with the most important person in the classroom, the teacher. So one thing I love about teaching is my students. I just love them. I think it's just very simple. I want to just go into a class and connect with the students. I love their energy. I love uh, enthusiastic energy and uh, go with the flow. Children, what is special about you is that the everyday energy, creativity and fun that you bring to my classroom. 21K connected me to all of you wonderful kids. Every day my students give me new memories to cherish. They amaze me every day. I am the best version of myself when I am with my students. Teachers play a very important role in building a manly society. Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru. When I grow up, I would become a teacher and I would handhold every child, whether he's an introvert or an extrovert, to be participative and to encourage them to do their best. Teaching is a job with a lot of variety and with a lot of responsibility. Teaching is a way of serving our communities. I like creativity and independence that teaching offers. The teaching is not just a profession, but a passion that I nurture every single day. I am the best version of myself when I am with my students. A teacher is such a noble profession that everybody, everybody respects it. Everybody admires the teacher. Teachers are one of the most important pillars of our society. They show us the path of success. I wanted to contribute to the society and I believe that being a teacher is an invaluable contribution. Also, a teacher is not only a teacher but a friend, a mentor and a confidant. Every day you greet your students with a smile upon your face. Though paperwork the night before seemed like a grueling race. Money is not your motivation, it's love for what you do. You hear that special calling to which you always will stay true. Your students are your dedication, devotion is to them. Do you each child's unique and special, a beautiful little gem. I have been a teacher since the last eight years. I love spending time with the tiny talks and this is one of the main reasons I have opted for the pre-primary section. I love their colorful and smiling faces and they really make my day bright. So I always wanted to be a teacher to make learning easy and filled with fun. The curious questions of my learners always excite me to research more and to learn more before going in front of them. The most memorable teaching moment here in 21K was observing the most exceptional and creative models of food chain made by my learners. I always wanted to become a teacher as I wanted to always be around children. It makes me happy to be around children and teach them. My teaching mantra is to always wear a smile and tackle every situation with a lovely smile on my face. And I would like to share one thing which excites me about teaching is like how the lovely innocent smiles of children change each and every day and bring something new to us. So why I became a teacher? It is because I love kids and teaching is my passion. It is, all, it is rightly said that once a teacher, always a teacher. Long back I started this journey and now I'm here teaching in 21K. Mine is just when, you know, the students are, you know, like probably with a misconception in science and when I just give the fact to them of a concept, they'll just sit over there and they'll be like, oh, wow. And that's like the face of understanding, which is so satisfying to me that they may retain the concept for life and not just for a assessment. Exactly. So teaching for me is not just about sharing my knowledge and experiences with my students, but it is a learning experience for students, colleagues and the community as such. It's therefore a lifelong process that includes new teaching skills, techniques and philosophies over time. I am passionate about teaching as a science teacher educator. I feel that students should develop on scientific temperament and thinking over time. My teaching goals are to actively engage students in a learning and teaching process. Today I am 
when I'm asked to express my views on exciting and enriching experience as a teacher, I would say that I stumbled upon teaching profession by chance. But today, after spending more than a decade, I continue to stay on by choice. I have amassed a wealth of invaluable experiences that have served to create an identity which I consider is the culmination of years of search to define myself. My thought of getting into the profession of teaching is a belief that teacher is the heart of education system. The duties I owe as a teacher are neither few nor small, but it's something that elevates the mind and give energy to the character. I've always wanted to be an amazing teacher as I was inspired by one of my lovely teachers during my childhood and they still inspire me to do better. I want to be the one who makes the life of the students bright and shining and guides them to a success. I love teaching because I can help others improve their skills. It gives me immense joy and excitement meeting learners around the world. In my class, I work with wonderful enthusiasm and optimism. Ma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo Maheshwara, Guru Sakshat Param Brahma, Tasme Shri Guru Namha. I bow down to all my facilitators, all my gurus, and I salute all the facilitators of 21K who are like Brahma, Vishnu, and Lord Shiva. And I wish you all a very happy Teacher's Day. Thank you. Do you know about the happiest moment in a teacher's life? Yes, when their students are prospering in their life. I came across two teachers who not only taught me but also inspired me. The two evergreen teachers that we all come across in our daily lives are time and experience. Hello everyone. Wishing all the teachers out there a very happy Teacher's Day. It is our day to celebrate for the inspiring role models that we have been for the young minds. For me, my most memorable teaching experience has been when one of the students came to me with this portrait of mine, which was sketched by him. And it truly inspires me every time I look at it and I want to uh, give more knowledge and have more fun with my children. Which is why my teaching mantra is stay young and have lots of fun. I am Dr. Kushku Agarwal and I wish you a very warm, happy Teacher's Day on my behalf. Teachers are what which forms the backbone of our personality and I really, really respect them a lot. My teachers and all the teachers around the world who contribute to the development and growth of the younger generation. Hello everyone, my name is Imanshi Bharadwaj and I am primary facilitator English at 21K school. A few years back I read a story, The Fun They Had by a famous author Isaac Asimov. And I actually love that story because of one reason. Because you know what, in 1951 when that writer wrote about it, he was actually talking about a virtual classroom there. Yes, you heard it right. In that story, the protagonists of the story, there are two main characters and they are actually studying in a virtual classroom. And when I landed up here at 21K, I was truly fascinated because yes, the, the same story actually played in my head. Oh, is that really possible? But yes, it is. Here at 21K, we teach our students not only just the way we used to be taught by our teachers, but now we make them technologically savvy we prepare them for life and yes we follow the skill based curriculum and i truly love being here hello everyone i'm dipyangana chatraj i am a teacher of pre primary school here so today is teachers day and i wish everyone happy teachers day being a teacher and as well as a student this day is very special to me because it is all about learning. Truly one of the best part about teaching is also being able to learn all of the things. 
students don't need a perfect teacher students need a happy teacher who is going to make them excited to come to school and to help them grow love for their learning it's not like i always knew better to be honest i still learn sometimes but when i think if i would have never accepted the flaws in my thinking and my behavior i would have never been able to evolve into the person that i am today i'll be honest i used to make fun of others who didn't seem smart enough or good looking enough to me i did make fun of somebody's ethnicity and in all of it and unfortunately there was nobody to knock some sense into me back then it was later when i went to college and met my mentors i learned how to accept things as they are i learned that i am not entitled to pass on a judgment on somebody else's decision and that is exactly what motivates me to pass it on to the younger generation and what is the better way to do it than being their own mentor the same mentor i needed when i was I also wonder why you know I wanted to be a teacher or why I chose uh, teaching as an option. Let me be very honest with you teaching was never an option for me. It was never in my bucket list. I always wanted to be let's say an engineer or an, a business woman where everyone looks up to me. It was my mother who chose this career for me and I give all credits to her. Somehow she thought I being a very tomboyish person I would be a great teacher. But I don't know why. and today i feel that her choice was the right one i'm sure you know many years ago she thought you know i could manage the home the school i would be a career woman etc so but right now i think uh, that's the absolute right choice for me i don't see myself anywhere except being a teacher a teacher always like they say at home you know you are uh, you are a teacher in class not at home so stop teaching us but i feel the teaching quality is always there whether i'm talking to my husband to my two grown up daughters so i am a teacher i feel to make a difference in the life of my students and even if i've made a difference to one child i think my purpose in life has been it so i think uh, i am i am a good teacher i hope i am a good teacher and i think my students would vouch for it thank you mom for choosing this career for me aur nikha padhati hu bade pyar se samjhati hu बड़े दुलार से स्वर व्यंजन का देकर ज्ञान तोरण से रुचि कर बनवा कर शब्दों की करवाती पहचान इंद्र धनुष में सतरंगी रूप आसमान में चमक रही धूप इसके प्यारे प्यारे रूप देते क्षमता व खुशहाली का संदेश प्रकृति का सुंदर वेश यदि प्रकृति हमारी सजी रहेगी तो जीवन में खुशहाली रहेगी हर आंगन गुलजार रहेगा हर दिन जैसे त्योहार बनेगा I feel one of the most important quality of a teacher is to be patient and empathetic with the students. Every child is unique. Today, kids are excited about learning new things. Every day we deal with different emotions. Sometimes they are cheerful, sometimes they are dejected. We as facilitators should understand their needs. A good teacher should share unique bond with their kids, and I am sure that the kids will definitely reciprocate because they share a bond. Personally speaking, I never give up and keep trying until my students don't find solutions to their problems. Like in my class, I always encourage and ask my children to speak as much as they can. Happy Teachers Day to you all. Happy Teachers Day. Happy Teachers Day. आप सभी को शिक्षक दिवस की हार्दिक शुभकामनाएं. Happy Teachers Day. Happy Teachers Day. Wishing all the teachers out there a very happy Teachers Day.